All right. Um, have a race here at Spa for you uh, in our BMW hybrid in the ESS series. Um, kind of trying to alternate between the two. I don't know. Insta seems a lot more popular than uh, ESS, so might end up just skewing a bit more that way in the future. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. I'll keep going this way for a little bit longer, but um, it's a pretty good race. Um, I think I learned some stuff about uh, fuel <laughs> during it, and um, we'll, uh, I, we talk about that at the end of the race and uh, try and figure things out. Um, I think we did figure some stuff out, but uh, we'll show you here, and then uh, we'll come back and talk a little bit more. If you were to pit early, I think in the uh, LMDH, if you pit more than 40 liters, uh, you do have to, uh, you can change them. But there's no way in this race. So, uh, Jack, did you screw up Polly like 80. I did? The air temp is 80 Fahrenheit. Sixth place. I don't know what's going on with race labs. Follow car number zero. Well, four. I guess they're, that seems realistic, I guess, as far as, like... I, I think I'm a different Jack, but yeah, I screwed up Polly too. Yeah, no, there's a uh, Jack Aiken in here for those things. But yes, I too screwed up Polly. Pit stop, uncheck tires. Pardon? Yeah, we got plenty of time. Okay, Josh, here we go. Green, green, green. We lost a spot. Isn't that what I said? Uh, I am slow down. Uh. Thank you, bro. Appreciate it. Car right. Clear right. Stunts okay. Now find your groove. Pit stop, clear tires. Okay, understood. Uh -huh. I told you it's more like I'm not doing that. <laughs> you still have that. <laughs> if only I could just have Jim drive for me, huh? And I'd run all the all the stuff he's supposed to do. I'd screw the fuel up somehow still. there. Cheers for that song.
Just done a one fifty nine point five. So Mitchell behind is now 0.5. Okay Josh, hold your nerve, just keep it smooth, no mistakes. like a bigger gap. I'm gonna get one. P5, you've just done a 201.7. I'm wondering if my setup is just like better. Cause like I seem to gap them pretty hard on some sections, but not so much on others. If I'm better than, or if like it's a difference in arrow or something like that. Mm -hmm. Keep it together, Gavin. It's closing you down. The gap has come down to 0.8. Thanks, Jim. You're such a bearer of good tidings all the time.
an incident in the chicane. We think it might be Aisley. That was a 202.0. Focus on your exits. One great. I'd like some draft, please. What was that? Uh, sorry, man. But you break uh, way too early. If I'm breaking too early and you're behind me, it's your job to overtake me, not just go up my ass. Okay, Josh, we're gaining on the car in front. The gap's now 0.5. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Sector 3 is 1.4 seconds off the pace. There's an incident in La Source. The gap to Mitchell behind is now 0.6. Faster than Gavin or no? The gap in front is now 1.0 seconds. Uh, Vector, thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. What's your Victor, Vector? Exit from the source. And Charles is closing in on us. We overshot that by a landslide. Oh my gosh.
coming up on a slower class car. The actor Mitchell behind is now 0.7. Did not go the way I expected him to go. All right, Josh, don't let this guy distract you. Slower class car Side's clear. Okay, Josh. Slower cars ahead. These guys will be fighting for position. They might not see you. The gap ahead is now 0.4. Right side. Right side's clear. Car right. Clear right. Side's clear. We're almost through them. <laughs> that, that took four seconds off of that lap. Man. Wow. That was uh, some painful traffic. I don't think... I think Charles got around somebody a lot more easily than I did. Could be wrong though. No, Charles got passed. Slower car ahead. He's the class leader for these guys. Okay, Josh, you've used half your fuel. The gap to Paisley behind is now 1.3 seconds.
Just trying to do the math to see if we would end up hitting the GTEs for a second time, and I think the answer is yes. That is bad. Because Jim did say on like the last lap or second to last lap. The gap in front is now 1.4 seconds. Um, like we were, our tires were dying. The pit window is now open. I do wonder, like, how much fuel we have to take on uh, to make changing tires free. The other guy said it was like 50 liters. I don't know if that's true. I don't know if anybody can look that up easily. Uh, 201.8 So I'd really hate to like lose this based on having my tire blow up, you know? Okay, so yeah, we'll be running lower fuel longer. The gap to Paisley. Because we, we, we did the early stop last time, you're saying? So I shouldn't have to worry quite as much. Rudy! Ready for the, the rain. It is now 1.4 seconds. Uh, how are you guys doing today? What did you, uh... It, it kind of rained stone earlier? I'm not under eight feet. We had, like, just hardly uh, a drizzle. Oh, God, so I've been 2K for the longest time. We're kind of fluctuating around that point. Nice! What was that? What's that Long Beach right now? That's okay. Like, also, like, you're like, what, 8K, 9K? F4? Nice. The numbers are for nerds, that's right. You were six. And it just makes the. I, at a certain point. At a certain point, like, it doesn't really matter all that much unless you're doing the special events, right? Because you're going to be in top split no matter what. Exactly. I mean, it'll, it'll get you in a different split in the big events. That's about it. And then also, like, the other difference is, like, how much farming you want to do. Yeah. I mean, I, I think... I think there's a fair... I think there's still a fair skill gap between, like... 2,000 and like 2,500 or 3,000 like I'm, I'm I pretty much get mopped Usually by the 3k 2.5k 3, 3k dudes not 100% of the time, but like I'd say 90 Yeah So still quite a bit to learn 
Oh, is this guy? This guy is really out of place, huh? Go wide, dude. Go wide, go wide. Thank you. I'm doing my best to learn multi class here. This is a fun car. I like it. Five laps of fuel left. Oh, we're coming up on um, our second go round of the uh, GTEs. I wonder. Uh, hopefully, we don't hit the front pack. Before we go in for fuel. Hey, Mitch. Yeah, wait, I have. Long time no see. Oh, it, it's a lot has changed since then. Uh, Rudy, I, is David or Evil Tech somebody or unknown knowns? Is anybody? Did we give Rudy a shout out? I can't remember. Uh, people should check Rudy out if they haven't already. I know, like a lot of you guys came over from there. I appreciate it too. I just I can't do the shout out myself at the moment for reasons that should be pretty obvious. Oh, where? I can't see, I can't see, I can't see. There we go. Hmm. Toad of the last. Thank you, Evil Tech. Appreciate it. I couldn't figure, I don't know. I was never very fast in those Formula 4 cars. But I guess I didn't give it my all as far as like trying to get quick in them. I only ever really did him that serious in uh, Kyle's league. Oh, we're catching the P2s now. You've just done a 201.2. Sector 1 is 0.3 off the pace. Sector 2 is 0.5 off the pace. Sector 3 is 0.4 off the pace. Uh, thank you for the uh, follow there. I, I didn't want to go too wide through La Rouge. Oh, come on, buddy. What you doing? This guy is dangerous. Okay, Josh, stay close. Wait for him to make a mistake. I should probably have pit there. There's an incident in La Source. There's an incident in Radion. Right 
I thought that the GTEs were in the pits. That's why I didn't go in. But I should still have, still have done. The gap ahead is now 0.9. If he doesn't pit, we're pitting. Group of slower cars ahead. Yeah. On your left. Clear left. Left side. Clear left. Incident in Bruxelles. We think it might be Mitchell. Five minutes of fuel remaining. Five minutes. We're halfway home. If he doesn't... If we pit now, we've got to go through that traffic again, right? Oh, gosh. But there's still more traffic to come. Yeah, we'll just do whatever he doesn't do. Car right. Looks like P4 has gone off in the chicane. Clear right. We're running on fumes, mate. In this lap. Box this lap. P3. Slower class car ahead. We're not going to catch this guy before I look home. The gap to Aisley behind is now 2.2. Car left. Clear left. I think he's going to have to go through all that traffic again. That slowed us down so much that other time, so hopefully we don't. And there's still quite a bit of traffic up ahead. This this big pack coming up on a slower class car. We're running on fumes, mate. Is the one that slowed us down so much previously. They're more spread out now, though. That's a good spot to catch him. We could maybe stretch it one more lap. We really try. Left side, clear left. We're hitting that left wall. Side, look out for the pit speed limit. Pit lane speed limit is 80 kilometers per hour. Clear left. We'll fill you to the end of the race. Seventy-seven percent tires. We are way good. Okay. Gavin's back ahead of us, though. The pit exit is My clear. Leg. Push now. A lot. Disengage limiter. We lost eight seconds on that pit stop. Wow. There's a 
was an incident in Lakumi. I mean, like, I don't know. Did I take too much fuel? How's my fuel? It should be about 32 minutes of fuel remaining. 2.5 liters per lap. The gap in front is now 8.6. How much did I wasn't listening to Jim? Thirty-two minutes. Much? Maybe a bit much. Slower class car ahead. Ah crap. On your right. Clear right. One. Okay. Stay on it, keep digging, P10. Car left, clear left. Nice! So you found your combo? I take it. See how that can get you eight seconds. The gap ahead is now nine point three seconds. You don't have to, uh, Jim. Um, last week I did not, and it was fine. can be helping oh yeah I did I did hit the pit limiter early eight seconds worth though okay I like the baseline or not baseline the sprint the set up for the I racing sprint set up for the TCR. Coming up on a slower class car. Mostly just because I got I got used to it. Oh, we're gonna catch this guy at a rouge, aren't we? Yeah, I can see that. Ooh. This actually worked out quite nice. I'm still hoping somewhere deep in my dark, dark heart that he uh, did not take enough fuel. Uh, 
it was 50 50. Like some weeks I, I would just use the iRacing fix setup. Because there's a different. They, I mean, there is an iRacing one there's for. An incident in the chicane. Um, Coming up on a slower class car. Yellow flag, keep your wits about you, mate. Crap, that was. That's gonna cost me. Okay, Josh, the next car is Guo. You're really good at fuel saving? I have no clue. Side's clear. That's 20 minutes to go. 20 minutes. Yeah, it was it was like maybe 50 50 um running like some weeks i would run another set some weeks i wouldn't i mean like in imsa oh i didn't do G I, i'm doing this i didn't do G gt3 i don't know about gt3 i would think like gt3s the tires are kind of designed to last about an hour and the the IMSA races are 45 minutes, so like you should be good. That's what I'm wondering. Clear left. Clear left. If I started with like less, I think I no. Well, I started with as much as I, I'm allowed because I this is just the the i racing uh, high downforce set that's been like I just it's tweaked it's it's it a it's tiny it's tiny it's bit. Like Leaving the pit lane. The next car is Aitken. V9. Uh, this is just um, crew chief. How am I behind this dude? Oh, he hasn't gone into the pits yet. Lead cars pitting. Yeah, uh, crew chief, it's a separate program. Um, uh, no. I don't like you can I'm running a very high downforce set wise so like maybe he's running like a really slippery one and he just got like way more fuel efficiency than me I don't know Was William ahead of me before we went into the pits? No, William was like a couple seconds behind me. Good lord, I lost a ton of time on that pit stop. Incident in the chicane, left side. Clear left. Heads up, there's a car rejoining. E8. Because we were like two or three seconds ahead of Paisley when we went in, weren't we? I just, I must have just, that was a bad pit stop. 
That makes a big difference. Lesson learned. You coming up on a slower car? I think I knew it, but I just didn't want to screw it up. You pulling away from the guy behind? The gap's now 7.2 seconds. Car left. Clear left. Yeah. 15 minutes left, that's 15 minutes. Keep it nice and smooth, come on, let the race come to us. I think the pit stop may have really messed me up on this. So everybody's gone through now, right? Gap to Paisley in front is now 7.7 .7 seconds. Okay, Josh, there's a car exit in the pit. Heads up. No. P7. I, just, I hit my pit limiter too early. I was a little slow getting into the stall. And I probably didn't have the best approach like to the pits. But I have... Why is Ryu... No, you weren't part of that. I have had bad experiences with the pit stop entry here. we could have stretched for that long I guess that's why we were ahead of them and we're I mean I guess we weren't in draft for the entire time but man Paisley ahead is now 7.9. Yeah. Well, uh, that one dude who's like went in around the same time I did, that might be a thing, but any of those other dudes who. Like Gavin may have underfueled. Any of the other guys were able to get like an extra like five. Yeah, we will. Any of those other dudes who um, went 21 laps without fueling, they'll make it. Unless they like really whiffed it, you know, which as long as you're running crew chief or something like that, it's not a thing that's going to happen. And Jim's done me dirty a couple times, but it's not often. Hell, it looks like Paisley. Oh. Or you know that can happen. Oh, there's one spot back. So now we're back to where we started. We were only up like one position before we hit the pits. So If we can get that back, I would view that as a wild success. Yeah. The 
gap to Paisley. Behind is now 5.3. The problem is, I don't know if I can go this fast on a low downforce set, you know? was at 202.5 okay Josh 10 minutes to go that's 10 minutes left come on let's put this hard work to good use thanks Jim you got it bud yeah I wish it worked like that Nana said something about like setting it to attack for like the fastest sector so like and then put it back on balance for the rest of it. I I don't know how much, like, on some courses I could see that, like, not hurting your regeneration all that much, but I feel like we wouldn't regenerate enough battery if we did it like that. It could be wrong. The gap in front is now 9.2. I haven't tested it a ton. That's what I have. My right uh, encoder dial is the is that. So if I scroll it down right now, it'll go to attack. If I scroll it up, it should go to build. I don't think Race Labs is set to say that. I think it says like something else because it's like I'm using the Race Lab settings for the. W12 because that's what it has. to blame it on the tires but the more accurate assessment may be the latter If you're left, should be fine. There's an incident in the chicane. Okay, Josh, 10 minutes of fuel remaining. You're reeling this guy in. The gap's now 7.2. Yeah. Slower cars ahead. I this screwed guy's that up by a lot. They might not see you. Maybe I don't catch him until after. The top. Nice.
Car right. Clear right. Yeah, I, we did that turn one on, on purpose to make a... Uh, that was all planned. All planned. Slower class car ahead. Five minutes to go, five minutes left. Car right, clear right. We gained like two seconds on him somewhere. Last lap. I didn't know where things were going to end up. I was going to kind of hope that I was kind of hoping that we would. Yeah, I know. I tried to set it back to balance um, at the end of Camel. I kind of forgot. Kind of coming up on the end of the race here. It kind of doesn't matter anymore. did it a couple of the other day. The, the, what's McCombs? Alright Josh, we estimate you've got five minutes of fuel remaining. Yeah, I wonder what happened between Gavin and Josh.
I'm doing my best. I think we're just too far back for it to really end up mattering. Lower class car ahead. Oops, crap. One more lap to go. Very little fuel left. And we got two laps, Jim. Two laps of fuel, one lap of race. We are good to go. We got all our battery. We're just gonna set her to lightning speed. Full Mark five. Oh, come on, guys, don't. Are you know, we'll get on some slower cars. They're class leaders in this group. Car left. Clear left. Right side. Clear right. Well, that was not helpful. <laughs> Caught that whole group together at like the worst possible time. On your right. He's still there. Right side's clear. The gap in front is now 8.8 .8 seconds. Mitchell is now leading. Just two minutes left, two minutes to go. Hmm, <sighs> oh well. Sixth place, that's it, we're done. Yeah, I'm happy with our, our, we finished where we started, you know. Yeah. We, I will, uh, Mitch, I'm gonna do a cool down. Yeah, it went. The, the numbers are gonna go in the right direction. Ooh, that, my wheel gets all wibbly wobbly on the straight here. Yeah, that's the that's the thing, right? Like, I think we could have we could have. I think we could have been ahead of Gavin. Um, I think we were thinking about doing the next DSS. It's, it's too far away from me. Wibbly wobbly. Uh, yeah. I, it's Spa, right? You, I mean, it's a pretty familiar track. Like I, onward, I, I wasn't gonna do. Um, Insight, because I'm not. I don't know Barcelona at all, and I wasn't making it around in one piece. But if you can make it around in one piece, oh, ones are pretty good. I hit the pit I hit the pit limiter like here or something. Watch your speed. Which I guess I should have hit it later. I don't that's so much time. 
Where's his... I don't know that his pit spot is like right in front of mine. I see that I worry about going in too hot. Yeah. All right. So tires front left is 65, 48, 51. Front right is 55 or 55, 51, 71. Um, backs are like lowest is inside left is 68 there's 80 67 68 and then the right rear is uh 71 70 and 85 i did not take tires no um as far as the setup can i change it still chassis i just changed it and for fuel because we're taking 14 and a half gallons which is the maximum you can take. Oh, you guys can see it. Um, I don't know if this is what's messing me up. Oh, where's his name? Gavin, 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 Gavin. Gavin, what was Gavin's number? 18. What lap did we pit? Am I sure about fuel? It won't let it go any higher. Like I click the so we hit garage, go to fuel. Like I can take it down. I can't take it up. That must be the max, right? I don't know. Sounds right. I mean, I can put it in metric here if that helps you. Yeah, 55 liters. Um, done. Fuel. He gave me 36 liters. I don't know. I'm not good at making setups. I never claimed to be. Uh, where did he pit? Hmm. My in and out laps were... Oh, eight was my initial or initial lap. Eight. This must be the end lap and then three. No, this is here. Here we are. So yeah, I lost like this was a really slow lap 16. So his must have been 15, right? Gavin. Yeah. I guess that traffic, well, it's a combination of things. Is it the amount of time that he took in there?
He had a better entry than me. Um. So what? We'll go to like our fastest lap. And then we'll zip to the end of Kemmel Strait and see how fast he's going. Three oh six and my best lap. not that fast like 296 so yeah I'm just too draggy yeah so I was just guzzling down the fuel with all that drag good to know good to know no, I had zero X race, so like, um, unless I had damage from like the way I took, um, what do you call it? Um, Arouge, yeah, I kind of doubt it though. I think, I think, because like a dude on, um, a dude on YouTube in my YouTube comments said, so "Yeah, see, and that's it. Like, we're, I'm, I'm, I'm face, I'm, I'm fast, I'm safe, and I'm able to get uh, decent times." A dude on YouTube said, "Like, it's pointless to run anything but, but high downforce because the drag penalty is not that bad." I'm like, I don't know. Um. Anyway, we were able to get six. Uh, we got a. Big hefty chunk of safety, decent chunk of eye rating. Um, I'm more interested. Championship points though. How'd we do? 82. I think that's what we got in the in the last one. Well, this gives us Mitch. This gives us a mystery to solve, right? Chapter three, Mitch's artfulness. This chapter will discuss, okay, whatever. Um, what was I looking for? Results. Uh, no, we got, we got four more championship points than the previous race. Um, I just, I've, there's, I've got too much garbage on the screen already. So yeah. Um, <laughs> the the drag from the high down for a set probably did us in i'm guessing uh we may, may have been able to get an extra spot or two uh if we were trying doing a different but maybe not wouldn't have been as fast i don't know um i don't know if i could have kept the car together with a with a lower down for a set it's what i practiced with so um we'll we'll take this under advisement going forward uh I don't know how Watkins is gonna gonna work with this and uh, Lamar too, especially. So we'll see. Um, but yeah, um, <laughs> this this fun race. Uh, I had a good time. As uh, yeah, <laughs> it was a good race. And uh, if you if you liked watching it, uh, hit the subscribe button. It super helps out a lot. Uh, thumbs up if you liked the video. Thumbs down if you didn't. If you want to watch long live, head on over to Twitch.tv/slash/thepiltdownman, and uh, we'll see you next time. Bye.